As the good day Siouxland crew enjoys the warmth of our heated studio, our very own Rebecca Pryor is live, currently braving the elements out in Yankton. Rebecca, what's it looking like in the Rushmore State? Yeah, Hannah. Well, right now I'm actually inside. I'm in our hotel. We just kind of woke up, moseyed our way on down, and to thank them for their hospitality tonight, I got a handy dandy shovel. We're going to get outside. I'm going to update you on these road conditions, and we're going to clean off some sidewalks for them. I'm going to show you how this snow has changed. We reported to you yesterday it was wet, it was heavy. Today it's much, much different. As I get in and I start shoveling today, you can hear it's icy. It's easy to come up but definitely very icy. And I want to say to you older folks at home, if you're out there shoveling, definitely be careful. And if you can, you know, ask a younger person if they can come by, they could probably use the exercise and maybe the extra money. Right here to my right, we have a snow plow coming through. Um, so whether you are a big guy with a plow or just a little guy with a shovel, a lot of people are going to be out here shoveling today. I would say accumulations stay the same from how they were yesterday, probably still only about three inches of snow. The wind also continues to blow. However, no more snow is falling here in Yankton, South Dakota. We're going to be giving you updates throughout the show this morning, but for now, I'm going to toss it on back to you guys in the warm studio reporting live in Yankton, South Dakota. Rebecca Pryor, KCU 9 News. Doing some good work out there. Rebecca, thank you.